A good deed turns deadly. Good evening, everyone. I'm Debbie Cobb. Alan Marsden has the night off. 20-year-old Hillary Wilhite of Orville was killed last night while helping a woman who broke down along Lower Wyandotte Road. Action News Now reporter Laura Eng is following the story for us. Laura. Debbie, a family friend, told me that Wilhite had the biggest heart and was well-loved by her friends and family. This is a photo of Wilhite provided to Action News Now by her family. The CHP says Wilhite stopped along the road with three other women to help a woman around 9.30 p.m. when they were struck by the suspected DUI driver. According to the CHP, Jasana Corona pulled over on the shoulder of Lower Wyandotte with car problems. Lissa Gramps, Winema Sutfin, and Hillary Wilhite then stopped to help. Investigators believe William Mandrill of Bangor was driving under the influence of marijuana and other drugs. He then lost control in a curve and crashed into three of the four women. Wilhite died of her injuries. Two others received major injuries. It's just a sad, sad situation, really. I mean, last night somebody was doing a, a kind act for someone else and it cost them their life because of that man's uh, selfish decision to drive while impaired, and it's just, it's really, really sad that that happened. Mandrill is charged with DUI and gross vehicular manslaughter. Mandrill is still being held in the Butte County Jail. His bail has been set at $229,000. Laura Ang, Action News Now. Thank you, Laura. The